is no line in the sand between land and sea. The oceans and the land we live on are all part of the same system. Beaches on Lihu, as throughout the tropics, are the product of parrotfish eating the coral, extracting the algae, and expelling the waste as sand. But just as bees pollinate flowers or birds disperse forest seeds on land, the nutrients that supply the coral reef food chain also need transport. This is the role of the birds, sharks, and turtles that fish in the wider ocean that surrounds. People from all corners of the world today witnessed something very special. None of us wanted to leave the water after what was one of the best dives we've ever done. We felt privileged to swim among powerful sharks and spawning surgeon fish and to witness the sheer abundance and diversity the Coral Sea has to offer. There was a tangible sense of energy. Today, we've enjoyed a once-in-a-lifetime experience. These warm tropical waters are highly sterile. Around these islands, upwelling brings nutrients to the surface and prey gets concentrated. The seabirds we can see here feed on flying fish, a high energy resource really important for raising infant chicks. All the other wildlife, marine turtles, sharks and so forth are similarly squeezed into these areas. Our several degrees of separation from nature has been gradually disconnected by advances in technology. Air conditioning, cars, and self-indulgence has isolated us, even from our own local environment where amazing natural events happen all the time. Go somewhere that inspires you, and for a moment, reflect on how your life is integrally connected to nature.